I've been at City of Hope for uh, 29 years, and I've been involved in diabetes research for the entirety of that period of time. City of Hope actually have made significant contribution to the patient care in diabetes through a variety of discoveries. Researchers at City of Hope were the first to define how insulin works, the role of insulin in mediating glucose entry into the cell so that it can be used as a fuel. Our goal with diabetes research is to resolve type 1 diabetes through cell replacement and we are following here at City of Hope a variety of strategies to achieve that goal from modifying the immune system cell activities to replacing the insulin-producing cell when it's needed or expanding the insulin-producing cell in the body of the patients. I started the eyelid cell transplant program at City of Hope in 2002. Eyelid cell transplantation in the United States is really done on a clinical trial basis. What we have been doing with genetics research is going to also develop a fingerprint for each patient with diabetes and lead to customizing and personalizing the care that that patient is getting. Our first eyelid cell transplant recipient received eyelid cell transplant in 2004, which worked for about 10 years. In 2015, she received another transplant that actually made her insulin-free again, which she is enjoying up to now. There is a tremendous amount of uh, discoveries, and it's actually facilitating the development of very effective strategies uh, that I believe uh, will be achieved in the very near future.